Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Time is on my side. Yes, it is. Don't tune out, please. That's the only singing I'm going to do in this video. Time. Don't have enough of it, that's for sure. Inevitably, we have to communicate with people who live in different time zones. And uh, that can be a challenge, especially if we have to juggle multiple time zones and we're trying to schedule something like a phone call. How do you do that? How do you figure that out? Especially if everybody who's supposed to be involved with one phone call is in a different time zone and they're using different systems. Well, you can create a perma time link. Of course, at all places, permatime.com. First time you go there, you set up your time zone. I happen to be in the Pacific time zone here in Seattle. And let's say I want to make uh, an appointment. I'm going to create a new perma time for 4 o'clock on Monday, the 9th of February, 2009. That happens to be my brother's birthday, as a matter of fact. Uh, so now I'm going to create the perma time. Now, below here, it's already got all the other uh, time zones that I've added uh, to uh, my, uh, I guess it would be my perma time settings people who I may communicate with on a regular basis who live all around the world. I press create perma time and instantly it creates a link, a hyperlink that puts the date and the time and the originating time zone. That's that that's the link that you pass around to all of your friends or colleagues, coworkers, whatever. So if I zoom out, it'll tell you uh, this perma time's 4 days away in the Pacific time zone. It's going to be at this time. In Chagos, it'll be this time. London, it'll be that time. I can go in. I can add another time zone. So let's say I want to say um, France. want to say France and add. Suddenly now France is added. So that'll be at 1 in the morning. Boy, that's going to be a, an interesting phone call. That's for sure. Nothing to install. You just run it right within your browser. And you wouldn't really use this as a world clock. Uh, in the traditional sense of a world clock utility, it's more for setting up schedules. Never before have I seen an easier way to get everybody literally on the same page. That's how it works. Perma time. So you might want to perma link it, bookmark it. Just remember it. I mean, that's that's like just how are you gonna remember this? They say. Per, like okay, so if you're thinking of communicating someone who lives in a very, 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 very cold region of this planet, um, Bjork. If you wanted to communicate with Bjork, you could say she was on permafrost potentially. So you'd need to use perma. I'm trying to help you with mnemonic devices. I know I'm a mnemon. My email address is chris at perillo.com. Doesn't matter what time zone you're in, you can drop me a line anytime, day or night. You're also welcome to join us in our community of geeks at geeks.perillo.com. And yes, we welcome anybody uh, who uh, happens to be anywhere, uh, at least on planet Earth. We really aren't too hot on the uh, um, Plutonians these days. Not after that uh, DDoS incident a couple weeks ago. You're welcome to join us in the chat room, too. We're typically talking tech 24 hours a day, seven days a week, in conjunction with this live video feed. Like I said, happening all the time, even past midnight, at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.